Hey, welcome back. Let's continue our journey as we terraform this new planet. Hmm. I still wish to go down there. But let's first... Clean up everything that we've left. Hmm. There's one larvae. And one rare larvae. And here we need to deconstruct some computers. And let's see if there's anything else left here. Nope. Absolutely not. But now we can create this teleporter. Get back to the base and just drop all of this and get back. No. And just get back to where we were. Deconstruct the teleporter. And move further. And rinse and repeat. We have already been here. Or perhaps not. I would have definitely picked that up. There's one more crate. Gotten something here. Got some super alloy rods, and now let's drop this. Now, this, and let's get back. See if there's anything more. There should be frog eggs popping up soon. <clears throat> Let's see up there. Mm, one more crate. Hmm, there is another outpost. No, no, we already have been here. We can now remove everything. Let's see if we actually removed everything from here. Nope. this inside even but you don't need to so you see as long as you continue the scouting what's this production multiplier fuse 
can see this fuse in an optimizer to speed up generation time for machines that generate items. I guess uh, those are the mining. Mm, the mining machines. Let's grab this. And this. And get back to the base. Just drop everything off. And now there's nothing left there. Now we hit some more crates. Over there too. All right. Let's take everything with us, regardless if we need it right away or not, because that's not an issue anymore. We want to clean up everything that we have missed. That's another exit. And we want to get back down. Right, and let's drop this. See how easily these lockers get filled up. Was there another storage here? No, that's about it. And we just got the drone station. The drone station is going to enable us to automate um, lots of production process. Which is important because um, in order to get things really going you know, with the um, uh, farming and uh, exporting and etc. We need to make things more efficient. For example, those uh, fuel cells cost a lot of resources of all kinds and we need uh, drones to gather those for us. There were lots of crates beneath the starting area. And we might as well drop this off now. Alright, let's get back. Two more crates here. Have we peeked into this robot? No. That one gave us a chip. There's some raw aluminum here. There's another robot here. With another great tree. 
also another chip in this robot and we can drop this off Right, I'm going to fill up this room with lockers. That's what I wanted to do. Let's use up all this iron. And we can now rotate the teleporter. So that um, it is uh, the same distance to both sides. Let's get back. I know, I forgot to drop off this siren. Well, let's see if we have something <clears throat> else here. There is an uncommon larva. And more, and some common larva. <clears throat> At some point, there will be a machine which creates larvae for us. It's called an ecosystem, I think. And there's one more crate. Was that the robot? Yes. Right, let's go in this direction. That's just aluminum. And some more aluminum. And some more geodes. There's some kind of drill here. I'm not yet gonna go inside this cave, but we'll soon explore it. As well as the golden cave, I want to clear this one out. So, there are two robots stuck inside these trees. This one leads to the golden tree as well. Is there anything else? Mm, no, at the moment not. There's this crate. And we're back at the beach. I'm not sure where to go. I want to explore those caves first. The golden tree and the... Um, that dark one. But before that, we need to drop this off. Let's first explore... They are connected, more or less. Let's first explore this one, but we need to... ...drop off these resources, and we need to eat some and drink some. And we can now go back. Zeolite. 
Got some chips. More zeolites. Where does this robot say? Again about the larvae. I guess they could have been more creative with the messages, but oh well. Zeolite, Osmium. There is a lot of Osmium here. Mm, nothing too much here. Right, let's go deeper. Osmium, more Osmium. It's kind of beautiful. And I guess if we place our ore extractor here, there has to be either zeolite or Osmium available for mining. But I'm not sure if we're ever gonna need more than we can gather here depends on our goal if our goal is just to complete the game probably not if our goal is however to achieve um some hidden objectives like there were in the base game perhaps they are not um present here then that's all we need But the hidden objective, I mean not hidden, bonus objective was to leave the planet with, uh, I think, 500,000 Terra tokens. And that needed a lot of resources to be farmed. And a lot of game time invested. Until those resources are farmed and... converted to the export goods. More osmium. More zeolite. This off. Get back. There was some kind of crate here. Some rocket engines, and yeah, each drone costs at least one rocket engine and one of those microchips. What's this? Yeah, I placed items on the wrong side. And we're back to the zeolite site. So this cave is not as big as it looked. We're gonna clean that up momentarily. And we can then go towards the golden tree. Let's see if something is perhaps hidden here. Oh yeah. Another crate. Let's first clear our inventory.
So there's new suit, some flower seeds, some larvae even. There's a lot of larvae, <clears throat> sorry, under the water. Generally, but here they have a party. And we're gonna need those to perform our experiments and create some advanced insects, butterflies and whatnot. Alright, we're not gonna waste any more any more time. Oh we got a special larvae. The butterfly, advanced butterfly larvae that provides 600 bonus to insect production. Was that all? Let's do a quick pass to see if we missed something. There's one more axis here. Which leads back to the zeolite site. possible that we haven't found this hole. I mean this entrance to the cave when we explored the zeolite site. I would have sure mind out this. Yeah, we completely missed it. But now we've redeemed ourselves. Alright. Some more larvae. There is one more crate here. And we're at the golden tree. Start from this robot. There's a microchip, another larvae message. Let's drop this off. Alright. Now. Mm. There are some crates here. Let's empty this one. Check around here. Mm, there's nothing special around this tree yet.
Do these plants have some kind of role? No. Let's check around for more crates. There's one. Alright, and now we need to drop this off. Looks like that final crate is everything that's left. And then there's absolutely nothing else. Let's check this corner. That's a waterfall that leads... Oh yeah, that leads to the crater that has now completely melted away. We might as well check that up. But first let's get our teleporter. forgot to build the teleporter before I died and now we need to walk all the way back there all right perhaps I did that's strange uh, we do not have any resources with us and we it's like we haven't built a teleporter. Hmm. Let's see what that's all about. Wow, another star form crate. Who would have guessed it's right there near the beginning? So there's our waterfall. And here are the resources that we have lost. Let's see if we can build. No, I returned one pulsar quartz to the storage. So the storage got fragmented and now we are again without a teleporter. Um, but there's not much here. Check this lake. Mm. That's just bauxite. Some larvae. Mm, there is not much here, so let's get up near that biodome. There's another robot here. And lots of stuff. But I'm not gonna, not gonna deconstruct that to save the inventory. 
And let's see what's in store for us here. First, let's check around. There's nothing. And here we have one computer chip. And another one. And is it possible that now we have some machines to deconstruct too? There's another chip. So basically, we have six more machines here, but that's nothing too critical. At this point, we'll get back. I don't know. When we need those chips. But we'll be heading in that direction soon. Where does this lead? Um, that's another cave. Full of osmium. And there's our pulsar quartz. So. We can now do. What was originally planned. Drop this off. There's no more space anywhere. Now we can deconstruct these. gonna move the teleporter well, let's see if there's anything we might have missed you want to check the access to this crater too there's one crate What about here? Nope. And that's our way home, but the teleporter will be our way home. That's the zeolite site, and out there are the crystal formations, which is the last big area that we haven't yet explored other than that beach which is quite new but beach is close to the base so we'll leave the teleporter here and we're now gonna drop this off all right we're gonna take a break here if you like this episode hit that like button down below subscribe and i'll see you next time